Hello, welcome. In this short video, let us look at the proof of the binomial theorem from probability theory perspective. So, our goal is to prove that the binomial theorem that is a plus b power n is equal to the summation k equal to 0 to n, n choose k multiplied by a power k multiplied by b power n minus k. This is the binomial theorem. So, we want to prove this using a probability fact that is given by the summation k equal to 0 to n, n choose k, p power k into 1 minus p power n minus k is equal to 1. That is the fact that the binomial distribution is normalized. So, we want to use this fact to prove the binomial theorem. So, basically we want to derive 1 using 2. Note that here a and b are positive numbers and p is between 0 and 1. 0 and 1. So, let us start with the RHS of the equation 1. So, starting with the RHS of the equation 1, we have summation k equal to 0 to n, n choose k, a power k into b power n minus k, where a and b are positive numbers. So, we have, now let us define, uh, since given, uh, since we have that a and b are both positive numbers, we can define the value a as a multiple of two values, that is a plus b, and the fraction p, where fraction p, where p is a proper fraction, that is it lies between 0 and 1. So, since a is, a is positive and b is positive, we can easily justify, we can easily justify such a relation. Now, by using this, by using this definition, we can easily show that b is equal to a times 1 minus p by p. But since a is equal to a plus b times p, this is equal to a plus b times 1 minus p. So, by inserting this value and this definition and this value of b in the original RHS, we have summation k equal to k equal to 0 to n, n choose k, a plus b times p power k and a plus b times 1 minus p power n minus k. This can be rewritten as summation k equal to 0 to n, n choose k, p power k into 1 minus p power n minus k. And then we have a plus b power k plus n minus k. So, the, so since this case, these two case cancel out, we have a plus b power n multiplied by the summation of the binomial distribution, which is basically 1. And the total probability under the binomial probability mass function, so which is 1. Therefore, a plus b power n, that is, is equal to the summation k equal to 0 to n, n choose k, a power k into b power n minus k. Hence, the binomial theorem is proved. Thanks for watching.